Hey guys, it's Wolf, your one and only, and welcome back to Indie Games. Yeah, I'm bringing back Indie Games to the channel along with some Genshin and, you know, probably some other popular games that pique my interest. So, today we're going to be checking out Beacon. Uh, I remember this game, but I never actually got to play it. I got this pack from, like, the Black Lives Matter package, which was, like, $5, if I remember correctly. And... It had like a hundred or nearly a thousand things inside of that bundle. So I was just like, why not? And I need to go through all of them and, you know, pretty much see what I got out of all of it. And Beacon was actually one of them that extremely piqued my interest out of that bundle. So let's go and try it out. It's also on Steam too, actually. I can just show that right now. It's actually on Steam and has barely ever been like reviewed really. So I'm I'm kind of curious like what's going on here. I'm sure they'll get a lot more people interested as soon as it's like out of early access because that's how it works really. A game blows up once it's out of early access and you know it's like full. You're just sitting here like oh I never heard of this game before. It's been in early access this whole time. <laughs> but yeah we're gonna be trying it out seeing how it is. It is a roguelite and it is a top-down shooter. That I can't say. Emergency triage assessment. Okay. Pilot deceased. Oh, am I dead? <laughs> I guess. <laughs> New clone detected. Oh. Initiating virtual. Maybe a Reese. No, I didn't recently get on um, Steam actually. Been out for a while yeah. since like February. So do I push reload? No, it automatically reloads. Okay, cool. I mean, right now it's really smooth. I can say that. Okay, space is gonna be my dodge. I have a set amount of dodges. Didn't realize. <laughs> Dodge roll. I kind of already did that. Dodge roll. Use crate. Why is she so passive? <laughs> okay, assault rifle. Low accuracy. Plasma rounds and automatic. Okay, cool. Fire weapon. Switch weapon. Okay, so I can't scroll. Use grenade box. Throw grenade. Melee. Melee? Oh, I have a melee button. <laughs> nice. So these are all heals. Oh, okay, so the little, uh, right here is actually my stamina. So for when I roll or melee. Key. What is this? I, I have no idea what that did. Data. Luck increase HP decree. Wait, what? I, I'm confused about that. Use crate. All right. Activate pickup. Flare shot. Throw explosive flare. Ignites enemies. Okay, cool. Q to activate pickup. So, how much of Q do I have? And what does it use? Okay, it uses this. So, I only have like 
Feudos. Storm cell incoming. Oh. Um. Okay. So swap. No, I can see a little reload time. Constantly fire causes shots to pierce. Anything else over here? No? Alright, let's go. I mean, so far it's like really cool. I like it. Deploids a barricade. I mean, a barrage. What, where did I get barricade from? Hello? Am I okay? Okay, so that's an actual like skill cooldown. Oh, did, oh god, when it said it was its accuracy was ass, <laughs> it was not joking. Luck increase speed. Wait, no, luck increase speed decrease. Wait, what are these things? Can I actually equip them? Is what I'm trying to like figure out. Okay, checkpoint. Simulation complete. Okay. Oh, okay, so they're like equipment that I can bring in and put on myself? Yeah, DNA type. So this is the roguelite aspect of the game. DNA mods. Oh, time two stats. When a hard reset will clear all modifications, mods from your, uh, Okay, so this can't be undone. So I can only equip one from each. So... Uh, damn, dude. Do I want to go like a... I could equip this for speed and put in some luck. Just so they can kind of not hinder me too much. Oh, there's a faction bonus. What does luck do? <laughs> That's the real question we should be asking here. What does luck actually do? Like, I like the sound of speed, but I also don't like the sound of losing out on a lot of stuff. You know, we're just gonna go with that. Okay, so it converts to leftovers. Sequencing genome. Noted. Uh, I was getting down to that, dude. <laughs> Play it back. <laughs> Let me check something just in case my recording is like screwing up because I've had some issues on like live stream for some reason my mic just screws the hell up. All right, cool. Everything is fine so far. What's this? Focus injection. Reload speed and accuracy. Okay, so that's a passive. Oh, I could just throw that off of me. So I don't get to keep my guns from the earlier stages until I die. It's once I complete the stage and it just ends. It's mostly the data that causes the roguelike aspect. Noted. These guys don't start shooting until I... You're actually close. Oh, I didn't even know what the hell that was. I thought that was a projectile. I didn't even gonna lie to you. Ow.
I was gonna melee it. That was definitely the wrong choice. Oh, that gives me DNA. Ow. What the fuck, dude? Keep your filthy slime to yourself. What's over here? Oh, just, uh, trees? Of healing. So I need to explode. Oh god. Oh, what the fuck is all this, huh? Hello? N Nani? Random events? Random events? Okay, so melee really doesn't do anything, from what I realize. Stop it. I was over there looking at stuff, just chilling. To out of nowhere, some BS happens. Okay, what is what is up with you guys? Like, what's up? I even tried the dodge roll, and somehow you still hit me. <laughs> I can eat these guys also. That does that not bother anyone? Oh, that's a boss. I didn't know. I didn't know. I didn't know. Eh? Stop it! My health! Can we not? Can, can we? Oh god! You know what? Try to learn where the best spot to toss a grenade is. It's really annoying to try and get it. <laughs> Considering they they move so fast. Bring it around town. I used up all my fucking grenades trying to see it. <laughs> I was just so curious. Okay, so just don't melee those at all. That's what I've learned. Can I get a new weapon anytime soon? <laughs> Maybe I would have one if I would have just exploded this. Ah! You bastard! The hell was that you just threw at me? You stop that. Life multiplication. Okay. I don't know where you're taking me, but I don't even know where I'm going, actually. <laughs> Soon I shall meet my demise. What? What's this? Oh. That, that's kind of what I was thinking it was, but, you know, I wasn't too sure.
Okay, so we have grenade again. Ah! Ah! Guys, can we fuck off, please? Let's. I don't know what that is he's charging up. I want nothing to do with it. What you got? What you got? Tesla spike? Deploy the spike Tesla. That cursor. Okay, so this is a skill. At least we finally got a skill. I don't know if I want to go that way or this way. Apparently the game is telling me to go this way. Okay, there we go. So that's how you do it. You use it. We're gonna die soon. Oh, he just got squished. Get fucked. So this is the other side. Like, other way around. Ah, reload! Am I? Sound to come back, please. Thank you. Shoot that, thank you. <laughs> so I'm kind of curious if this actually does blow that up. It does. Okay, so that's going to be my most used button there. <laughs> Oof. <gasps> A gun? Fires three bolts. All bolts. Oh, detonate on uh, reload. Okay, nice. I just got healed by a little bit. <laughs> Not a lot, but you know, a little bit. Heals me for my life. Okay. So instead of accuracy, I could just take that instead. There's three charges compared to that passive, though. Woohoo! I just used it for the hill and just said, you know, dude, I might as well just put it down. Best strat. Can I self reload? Is that. I think. Okay, now. Does it hurt me too? Uh, yeah, it does. Okay, noted. <laughs> so this thing is dangerous to myself more than anything. I might have to go back for that heal. <laughs> I am an endangerment to myself. Die. <laughs> I'm gonna go back for just for this little hill, don't mind me. Wolf has made some mistakes and you know he, he he's not gonna live with him at all. How dare you even think that I will. <laughs> you know, that's that's fine. Eighty percent. Yeah, I'll take it. I'll also take that I am definitely an endangerment to myself. <laughs> Can I get a safer gun? <laughs> okay, there was something over here. I can definitely say the map looks beautiful. Like, very well done on the map. Lots of evil enemies as well. This is, this is like my first time fighting them. Yeah, that's bound to happen. 
can we stop burning? Oh, I gotta roll just to get that off? Okay, noted, 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 noted. Most people like me would have burned to death. Can you not? suffers a little bit, but that's fine. This is good for, like, clearing out uh, a whole bunch of minions. Unless the minions have dashes to destroy me. Ow, not again. Yeah, that one. And he has a deflect too, which doesn't help me. I'm almost dead. <laughs> I'm definitely going to die here. All that for Tesla ammo? <laughs> I haven't even been using my skill also, so that's also a thing that, uh, you know, happens. I wonder if I can make it back to that hill. <laughs> Everything's just gonna keep going back to that hill. Oh god! <laughs> uh, well, no. <laughs> yeah, I guess that answers my question. I'm not gonna make it. Oh god, there's a whole army. They definitely weren't gonna make, let me make it back to that hill. <laughs> they were like, nah, dude. <laughs> We've seen you go back to that hill like twice already. <laughs> we're just gonna end that. That's just gonna be short lived, buddy. <laughs> Oh, uh, okay. So we yeah. have, okay, so these are two like modifications that we can just hold on to. We don't have to like use them during a run. We have a choice to hold on to them. Uh, what I can do here is take this stamina upgrade, but I don't roll that much. So I don't think that would be useful out of me. I could do this and I can do I can do like a speed build, but meh. Let's let's not do that. <laughs> I think I want to keep this. Keep this. I don't know. I think I want to keep this. But then again, I don't know if I want to keep this because if I keep this, I don't know if I want to keep this. Makes sense, right? No question. I'm gonna get rid of it. Okay, I was curious of what this would do. Oh, new weapon. So that's what happens. Sequencing genome. Wait, did that speed increase when I last used it? Mutation detected. Ooh. Ow. Reduce cost of roll, but I can get fucked by fucking 40 per. <laughs> no, I don't want it. Can I take that off? Hello? No! God damn it. <laughs> We're stuck with choices that we made. Of course, just that one item I put on is just like, yeah, dude, fuck you. <laughs> but yeah, guys, we're going to end off there. Hope you guys have enjoyed a little bit of Beacon. As you can see, um, well, if you guys didn't see, my legs have changed. This is Beacon. Like, as soon as you're putting this DNA inside of your body, you were being mutated. So that mutation actually changed my legs. Which is actually pretty interesting. That's kind of the reason why I kind of like the unique idea because your character will always keep changing as you're going through all these stages. You know, you're dying, collecting DNA, injecting it into yourself. That's why you guys saw like many creatures of the same person on startup on their um, itch.io page. And plus you can just, you know, completely reset yourself to where you start back at normal. Then, you know, start re-rolling some things again and just see what you can get. But, I'm going to say this is a perfect game for anybody who likes top-down roguelikes, bullet hells, stuff like that. A challenge. Especially like your first go. 
Mm, perfection. I love roguelike games, and this one definitely hits somewhere in my pants. What? Anywho, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys on the next one. Until then, peace out.